Alright, so so tired. What's up everybody? It's Chica here and I am here today to do a nail polish, uh not tutorial, uh I don't know, basically like all of my top favorite spring nail polishes um someone requested this in like one of my videos from like a couple months ago originally you know i wore like regular nail polish and then i like probably like my senior year in high school i was able to get like acrylic and nails and it was so stupid but whatever <laughs> um that was like the style then and then after that like i went back to just like my regular nail polish and then i would get like the regular manicures um and eventually like my nails became strong again or whatever and I just continued to use regular nail polish and then um probably like within the last year I started getting like the gel manicure gel nail polish manicures and I loved it because obviously like your nail polish lasts like two weeks if not longer and your nails originally like probably the first week is super shiny the second week not so much but your nail polish is still you know there um and no chips or whatever but then when i used to like get them taken off from time to time like get the nail polish taken off i realized that my nails were becoming so weak so i did it that <laughs> and i went back to what i knew and that was polishing my own nails and toes and um you know give myself my own manicure but now see i do go um from time to time and still get like a regular mani and pedi um, but really it's not even necessary for me because I can do all the things that they do at the salon at my house. So enough rambling, let's just go ahead and get right into it. My favorite nail polish brands are Simple Colors, which you can find at Walgreens, Target, and I guess CVS. I don't know, I really shop at CVS. <clears throat> so Simple Colors, and it's like $2.99 a bottle, but I'm telling y'all, it's like the best $2.99 in a bottle ever. It lasts way longer than Essie, Orly, all of those other like super expensive brands. It lasts way longer than that and it's better. Like I know because I have like all of the brands. So I prefer my $2.99 simple colors over those. And also too, I prefer um, Sally Hansen Hard as Nail Extreme. Those are like so amazing. They're, the only downside to that is they're small. Um, and then recently I discovered the NYC's nail polish. Like I believe those nail polishes are only like $1.99. But I love them because they dry so fast. Like literally they dry in a minute. And they're called like the, the NYC they're actually called NYC in a New York Color Minute. So NYC in a New York Color Minute, um, they're quick dry and literally is like with the most quickest, driest nail polish ever. <laughs> so um, let's just go ahead and get right into showing you guys some of my colors that I love. I have like most of them here because I like set this up on um, back there somewhere. You can't even really see, but I put it like on top of my... Uh, Alex drawers for decor, but these are actually the colors that I use the most during that time. <laughs> these, and then I have a couple more in here that I just put there for now. And then all of those colors are on this color wheel. I don't know what this is called, but let me tell y'all, I I wanted to do a fall nail polish haul, but I went to find this because there was no way and you know what that I was going to take off the polish and polish another color and all this. I was not doing that on my nails, so <laughs> I finally found this. I think I found these at, I honestly don't even remember. I think it was Sally's I found these. I was so happy to find them. So, we're going to start with my first color here, which is this white which is a Sally Hansen a hard as nails extreme wear it's white in the color white on uh, it has the number 300 on it and it's literally just a white nail polish um, I love white nail polish love 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 it the only thing is it's like a little tricky to polish your nails you have to do a, like three coats so you won't see like the streaking in it it's like inevitable not to have streaks with white polish so you have to be very very careful when polishing your nails white but 
I love like year round, literally. I wear this in the summer, winter, fall, spring, anytime. Like it's just an everyday color for me. Um, and I love it. So white on. And then we have here an NYC color. Um, it's the Anna New York Color Minute Quick Dry. And it is in the color Fashion Safari 201. Um, love this nail polish. It's the perfect nude. And I actually have like a polish that's just like it. And I had no idea I already had one. And it's the uh, Sally Hansen Hardest Nail Extreme Wear, of course. Like I'm telling y'all, I only buy like three brands, I promise. Oh yeah, and this um, Sally Hansen color is called There It All 105. So There It All, same color pretty much as the NYC. Fashion Safari. Alright, so the next color is the NYC one again, and it's called Hampton's Peach, and it's just a gorgeous peach color. Um, I don't know if you can see it, but it is so amazing. It's like a perfect peachy coral color, um, and like I said, it dries like this, so it's so perfect, and it is very opaque, so I love that about it. Alright, the next color is another NYC one and it is called Sidewalkers. Um, it is just a chocolate, not chocolate, chocolate, charcoal, no, it's like the perfect like cement gray, I don't know, I can't even think of the color that I want to tell y'all it is, but it's just a perfect gray, I love, love, love it. Alright, so the next color is an Extreme Wear Sally Hansen. Um, everybody loves this color. Like, I've been wearing this color for like two, three years now, and it's the mint sherbet color. And it's just a perfect mint green color. I love this bad boy to death. It's, um, like I said about the white one though, you have to be careful when polishing your nose this color because it can leave streaks. So just be careful, but two, three coats will do it just fine and you will not be able to tell. So love it. This is like one of my all time favorites. So the next color is pretty new actually for me. Um, I just recently got it, probably like a month ago. And it's called Big Till. It's by Sally Henson again. It's the number 325. And I don't really like this color. I actually have probably worn this more than any of my colors so far. Um, I don't know. I just like it. It's a nice different color blue. I really, really like it. Moving right along. So now we're on to simple colors. Um, I have this pretty, it's like a blue, it's in between a blue and a purple. So it's like a, a I don't know, like a pale bluish purple color. It's so beautiful. It's the color Cell ID and I love it. Alright, the next color is a beautiful purple color and it's called Tempest and it's by Simple Colors as well. Um, Sally Hansen also has like a purple, this color, actually it's a little bit lighter, um, but I love it as well. I just ran out of it and I didn't repurchase it before I made this video, so I'm just going to show you this purple and it's just a pretty pastel purple color, reminds you of like Easter, I love it. Well, the next color is a pink. And of course we have to have a pink for girls, right? <laughs> um, so this color is pink forever and it's literally just a pink color. It's on the pastel side, so I do like it a lot. It's just a nice pink color. Like I said, you have to have a pink because you're a girl. So the next color, oh my god, I love this one. It is like a white, a off-white, but like an off-white pink. <laughs> So it's like the pink, but it's like the milkiest pink you've ever seen, and it can be mistaken for white, but it's pink. And it is called Easy Going, and it's the number three. It's the number 300. Um, I love this color. Love, love, love it. So the next color is my favorite color of them all, and it is yellow. I mean, if you guys watch my TMI, I think it's called TMI. My TMI tag, I tell you guys that my favorite color is yellow, and it definitely is. And this is actually like my favorite yellow nail polish, and it is, of course, simple colors. Um, this one has like a chrome like top on it because it's like the um the gel tech kind, so it's actually called Simple Shine, but it's a simple color polish. Um, and it basically just has like a super extra glossy finish to it, but it's so pretty. I don't know, it just has that gel polish look to it. So I love this color, and it is the Banana Appeal. 
Alright, so my next color is, it's a red, but it's like a tint of orange in it, and it's called Electric Red. Um, I love this color, and actually I should have included like a red polish in this video too, because red is something that you can wear like all year round, but um, I chose to put this one in there because it still like has the springy summer feel to it, since it has like the orange tint to it. Um, and like I said again, it's the Energetic Red by Sinful Colors. Alright, so the next color is another one of the Sinful Shine, Sinful Color um, polishes with the chrome top to it. And the color, ooh, I actually don't know what the color of this one is, but it's a pretty cobalt, cobalt blue. Um, I love this color. I love this color year round as well, but I figure I would throw this in this video because it is such a, a necessity. If you're a nail polish collector, you need a color like this in your life. So I'm not sure what the color is, but I love it. Get you a color like this. All right, so that was pretty much it for the regular nail polishes. Um, I have like just four more to go, but they're definitely not in the regular nail polish category. Um, I have this Sally Hansen Sugar Coat. Um, I only have this color and I got this like a year ago I believe and I'm surprised that it even still works. But um, I got it just because it was different and I wanted to try it. So the finish of this is like a bumpy type of deal. I don't know. It's weird but it's so cool and like I didn't even wear it last year but I wore it this year. So I really like this. Um, I don't know if they make sugar coats anymore, but I know they have a lot more of the textured nail polishes now. So, this particular sugar coat is called Razzleberry. So, Razzleberry, Sally Hansen, I really love it. So, the next two polishes are actually glitter polishes. So, they're polishes that I put on top of like my solid colors because glitter polishes never like actually look like what it looks like in the bottle. Um, you always need to put like a base coat on it, so like a light color or really any color that you want, honestly. Boy, this one is China Glaze. Um, the only reason I purchased this is because I got it from Marshalls and it was only $2.99. <laughs> and I just thought that it was like a nice, different color, sparkly type of situation. Um, and of course it has spring sparkles in it, so that's why I included it in this video. The next one um, is a Sinful Colors one as well, and it is, has gold sparkles all over it. I got this during Christmas. It was like during like a Christmas special edition type of deal, um, and I just love this. It looks like gold chunks like all over your nails, so I really, really like it with you. It's the NYC New York Color Matte Me Crazy. Now, this polish is so amazing because you literally can put it on top of any no polish that you want any. Um, I paired it with this for the sake of this video and for the nail wheel because um, black obviously you can see the madness of it much easier than any other colors. I love this and it does work. I'm telling you I've tried it on a lot of different nail polishes and all of them. This little $1.99 or $2.99 matte polish made the polish matte. So the last polish that I'm going to include in this video is a clear coat. It doesn't really matter what clear coat you get, but I included this Miracle Gel top coat. Um, this is the one where you're supposed to like use the Sally Hansen polish, gel polish, and put this on top. But I actually don't even like that. I feel like they were just like a regular nail polish. So I returned the two that I had purchased originally and I just kept this. And I use this top coat for all of my polishes and it makes all of them super duper glossy. So, we love this. Alright, so that concludes the end of my spring no polishes video. I hope you guys enjoyed and stay tuned for more. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you're not already. When I opened it up, I was like, oh my god, it's so cute. Like, I've never seen a box that had this type of detailing in it, and I thought that was just so cute. So they kind of won me over with the packaging, because I'm a sucker for nice packaging. Um, it came with this little pretty tissue paper, 